Hello, my name is Christian Waller from TradeVola, Trading with Know-How and Transparency. Today we want to present you a new topic and I think for most of you, trading with Interactive Broker is one of the most important topics, is how to use the TradeOut mobile um, app for Android or for iPhone. The mobile apps are pretty similar. We want to present it today for Android and we want to show you how to overview your portfolio, how to send orders, what are the main functions, how to exchange money and um, some other tricks and tips for the TradeOut mobile app. For this I made a few screenshots and I will show you exactly on the screenshots what to do and how to set up the TradeOut mobile app. And now we want to see this all on the screen. Before we start and show you all the details about the IBKR mobile app, it's also important to know that you can use this as your two-factor login system. If you go to your client portal and then to settings that you're going to find here next to the head and shoulder um, icon, then you need to click to secure login system. And instead of choosing the SMS, I recommend the IBK security via IBK or mobile app, uh, because if you change your number, you anyway have to deal with the IBK security app and the SMS is something what IB in the long term will anyway not support anymore. That's why the IB uh, mobile app, even if you don't trade with the IB mobile app, it's necessary to download via um, Google Play. If you have an Android phone or for um, iPhone, go to the App Store and download the latest um, IBKR mobile app. After you did, just follow the steps for the installation for the security app and then you can use it as your tool factor authentication for all devices, I mean for the trailer workstation, for the client portal or for the IBKR mobile app itself. And like I said, it's much better than depending on the SMS. But now let's start with the mobile app itself. That's something what you will see when you start the IBKR mobile app. If you don't want to start in the simulated trading or Maybe you want to change it to paper trading instead of the real one. Here you find in the right corner these three dots and there you can change the settings from simulated to live trading. It might change a little bit um, if you have the iPhone app. This is here done with um, the Android version, but most of the things what we will present in the next uh, few minutes are pretty much um, the same. So here you can also see IBKey authentication. Small things are still here in German, so um, because language settings on the phone are in German, but you can also change here the language settings on the IBKR mobile app, but just for you to know if you see something written in German in the next few slides. Um, it's um, not because I didn't change the language, it's just depending on the phone itself. So then uh, this will be the first thing what you will see. Um, we are logged in here in a simulated trading account. As you can see, it's always highlighted on top. And then you will find here the few sections home. That's the first screen what you normally see. Then we have portfolio where you can see all your positions. We have here also trade, watch list and account. These are the main things what you will need from your mobile app and then as well here you will find the menu with all the things what you can select and here you will find extra settings for languages or other stuff but let's start first with the menu on the left hand side ah no sorry we will just scroll a little bit down this is your um, simulated trading balance um, in the real account of course you will see first always your value as well as your performance you can choose here for the last week, for the last uh, month, or you can see the different um, time and durations below. And if we scroll a little bit um, down, you can also look here for um, deposits or withdrawals. Um, we have an overview of transactions, or if you want to see the statements, you can all access directly here. If you go a little bit down on the home screen, you will see your positions here. There's four positions in my simulated um, account. You can select here, for example, unrealized uh, profit loss or market value. If you have more than four positions, it might be interesting to sort them after 
some other things. And for this also nice information, you will see all upcoming events or positions what you have open. For example, here we have a fourth position open, what is upcoming earnings on the 6th of February. And this is for all positions in your simulated or in your live trading account there, depending where you logged in, where you will have this information. And some more information also from IB, where you can have a podcast or Traders Academy. All these you will find on your home screen. Just you need to do one thing. You need to scroll down and you have all information on uh, one hand. Now we will come to the menu like discussed before. Home screen, something what we saw already. I think portfolio, we will see it also later with uh, positions. Account is interesting because you will see also the different account balances and different currencies. What is also something what is really important uh, for IB users also to avoid um, a negative um, interest or some other fees. Watch list where you have an overview about all interesting stocks which you add or removed in the last time. And also here interesting, you can have the same watch list from the Trader Group station or your client portal also in the mobile app. Very important. Then under transactions, you can see all transactions what were done. Order ticket, you can create here your order. And I think the other stuff we will, I will just tell you what you will find there, but we will not have the time in this video to explain each and everything. Just the main important things what you use in the beginning. Because option, exercise or role, if you want to roll an option or exercise it, I think it's only important for people who really trade options. And even then, it's something what not everybody really uses in option trading. Event trader, you can trade on special events. And you can also have here scanning tools if you want to scan for um, specific uh, things. You have a trading assistant where you can set up some special orders um, which you might need. Also news and research is something where you can look for some more information on news. Trade worldwide, I think, shows you all the different markets. Also calendar, you see all important uh, things what are announced today or tomorrow in the calendar. Not only for stocks, also for different markets. And then you have the settings uh, where you can change uh, a lot of things for your account. That's the first thing, but it uh, goes or it continues. If you scroll down, you will see also here, trade, discover, transfer and pay. This will at the end bring you transfer and pay to the client portal where you make a transfer or withdrawal. Also account management is exactly what we discussed in the beginning. It's the client portal and the rest, I think, you can just read it. Help is, I think, clear. Two-factor identification we spoke about. And research and education is also something what we saw in the beginning on the home screen. Let's go to the watch list. Now we see exactly what I told you. I can import saved watch list from my trader workstation. If I say yes, we will import this watch list also here. And then in the end, it's pretty easy. You can just use here add instrument, type a symbol or name to add all the stocks or all positions or asset classes, uh, what you want to add to your watch list. Also here you can change the columns. To do so, you just need to um, use these three dots and you can add indicators or add columns here. Pretty easy to select. So next step, what I told you, it's a portfolio. It's the same what we saw the home screen, our four positions with the account size and the daily profit and loss. Also the same, you can change here all the columns. Also interesting, you see the total unrealized profit and loss then the daily profit and loss and also your buying power and all stuff what you need on one screen. And also cash balances we have here four different cash balances, especially if you're negative in one cash balance, you can easily change or close this position by clicking on this cash balance here or place a trade for this specific balance. Just make sure, especially now with the higher interest, to not have any negative um, cash balance um, because it will cost you um, interest every month. So now the most important is um, how to place a trade. And here we have the 
buy and sell selection. Normally here you place um, your stock, your ETF, CFD, whatever you want to trade. You can also do this directly from the watch list by just clicking on um, symbol. But if the symbol is not in your watch list and you want to trade a specific um, stock, you just have to type it here or use one of the last symbols uh, which you yeah, checked in your IBKR mobile app. Instead of just using buy and sell orders, you see some more stuff where you can also trade. This is something what is only um, important for option traders. Book trader gives you a little bit more view about the market depth. If you have the market data for it, you can see everyone who's on a bid size or ask size and how many positions are there. I think it's not really necessary, but you will find more yeah, tools for trading or trading related if you scroll down. But I think the simple, uh, simplest thing is here to use the buy and just the sell order. And if you select the symbol, for example, we have here Kameco Corporation. If you if I put CCJ, it shows me everything what is available on NICE or here on Frankfurt Stock Exchange, but it's a different stock. You can then select stock option or CFD or everything what is available to the to the symbol which you were looking for. And after you select it, you will see this screen where you have to select um, everything related to your order. It means how many stocks you want to buy, which limit, uh, which order type, which uh, limit price. And then also if you want to place this overnight, means um, in uh, post-market or pre-market, uh, for example. And uh, if you want to see more options, especially for long-term um, traders, I think it's important to have also the time and force settings or maybe some more settings, which you will see here on the next screen now. Here, for example, um, time and force good till cancel. Otherwise, if you select day, it will be only available for um, the trading day. Next day, the order will be automatically canceled or after the um, session ended. And what is also important is, I think, attach profit taker or stop loss. Because if you, let's say, find an interesting stock, but you are not checking every day, it makes really sense after you place your order to already attach a profit taker and a stop loss. So let's say, you buy here Kameco Corporation for $49. Let's say I want to risk $4, but I want to have a profit of $8. So it's very easy to classify or to set up your chance risk ratio. Also always good to risk less than what you want to take as a profit. For someone who has not so much time to check all the time his positions, I think it's very good to use these two functions with attached stop loss and attached profit taker. After you set up everything, just slide here to the right and the order will be placed and later on you can always change um, the order in the section transactions what we saw in the beginning you can change the price you can change order type everything what we set up here you can change later in the menu what we saw in the beginning yeah that's pretty much um, the main important stuff for ordering and for the ibkia mobile app yeah, I think it was uh, quite interesting to see all the main functions for the Trader Mobile app, how to use it, how to set up orders and um, all the other different um, settings, what you need to know to trade with your Trader Mobile app from IBKR. If there's any question, feel free to leave a comment or send us a message. We are happy to provide all information, what are necessary or um, requested here for the Trader Mobile app. And I hope to see you soon.